Welcome back to In Ohio Country today and from the Field Day demonstration, if you will, at Farm Science Review. Joining me now is Matt Apple from Apple Farm Service. And what a great day. Day number two has been. The crowd has been incredible. You're out here featuring your Helo, Helio uh, drones. Tell us about it. Uh, it's been a great crowd. Uh, we've had a lot of really good interest. Uh, Helio is a made in America drone. Uh, some of the some of the components are made from China, uh, but it's really hard to find everything in the U.S. nowadays and still be price competitive. So we do have the only United States manufactured drone. Um, it, we've got the largest drone on the market with 18 gallons of capacity. Uh, we've got an a AG230 that's got an 8-gallon capacity that seems to be the most popular in the area. Uh, it's, been a, it's been a wonderful experience so far running them, and we've, we've had them since April. That's right. We were with you when you introduced them to the uh, public and to your uh, uh, patrons. And i got to tell you, there's a lot that's happened between now and then. And let's tell us about that growth just since April. It's, uh, the interest has been terrific. We want to thank you for allowing us to set up in your booth here at Farm Science Review. I can tell you firsthand, the people who came in, every one of them were drawn to those Helio uh, drones. So I'm, I'm sure you've seen a lot of activity here, but let's talk about that growth since you introduced it in April till Farm Science Review here in September. Uh, we've had, it's been a lot of learning experience. Um, growth is, it's, it's been, um, we haven't sold as many as I would have liked straight out of the gate. However, uh, we've got a lot of interest. It seems like there's there's still a lot of questions, sure. a lot of a lot of uh, questions we have to answer, um, and it's it's just been a lot of learning. We're still we're still in the well in the learning stage of this. Yeah, I, I think if you get a few sold or get a few demonstrations out there, our farmers are always about return on investment. You know that. Oh, absolutely. So they're going to look for that opportunity to be able to get testimonials from people who had bought it and the kind of results that they've been getting here in Ohio. So we could show them as much video as we want, and we did. We did a couple stories with Helio, but they're going to want to see it themselves in what, in, in what is happening here in the Buckeye State. So the guys that we have gotten them out to have had a lot of really good luck. And one one gentleman that comes to mind, uh, he picked one up right off of our lot. We didn't even we didn't even prep it for him. He was ready to go. He grabbed it, and he got less. He got two thousand acres in, in less than two weeks. I mean, just cranked it out. Um, really got after it. And uh, I think the more people start to realize that this is going to be a viable option, the more it's it's going to gather. And uh, like I said. A lot of it is learning the, the learning process. What kind of setup you need? What kind of what kind of drone fits you? Uh, and then and then from there, you, you, you know, what kind of trailer? If you're going to run a trailer, you, you know, and there's just there's just so many variables with it. A lot of it's going to be just learning what's going to work best for you. And these field demonstrations are just a great opportunity for producers to see hands-on because they're out here already checking out the combines, the different tractors, the different field demonstrations. This just fits in perfectly to have you guys out here demonstrating these drones and that hands-on opportunity for the producers to check them out themselves, right? Oh, absolutely. And we've done a lot of personal demos already. Um, I get calls all the time. If, if you want a demo, give me a call. We'll, we've, got, we've got time. We've got some guys. We'd love to come out. We'd love to just sit with you personally and, and, and go through. If you got a couple guys or just yourself, go through your operation, see what fits you, see if our drone fits what your operation needs. And it's, it's been a lot of fun just getting out and seeing everybody and, and working with them. Matt, I understand you have your license, right? Yes. Yes, I recently passed, barely. Well, let's talk about that, though. I mean, what's the process so that our producers know th that what they need to do to be able to operate one of these? Yes. In the state, so in the state of Ohio, it's pretty easy. Uh, I, I Personally, what I did, and I know Jim Love, is, he's got a couple websites that, that are really good. Uh, you can go online. They've got drone. Uh, I use Drone Launch Academy. I subscribe to it. I studied one day. I took the test the next day. You have to have an FAA 107 unmanned pilot uh, pilot's license, and then you can file. It's a paperwork, uh, a paperwork filing once you have your FAA license for a 137 exemption. Mm -hmm. Once you have that, you can spray. And so what's the time frame on, on start to finish to get that? I'd say start to finish, you're a couple months. 
And you guys can help them with that. You can do that, right? Absolutely. We can help you walk through the process. And in the, also in the process, too, is getting them trained on, on this particular device. I mean, you guys are, are getting to be experts on it. So once they do purchase it, they get their license, you guys will be there every step of the way when they want to use it in their farming operation, right? Absolutely. And I, I, will, I will say this. The one, the, the great thing about Helio, the, the, the thing that we like the best is, uh, and I'll give, you, I'll give you an example. One of the first demos we did, we were having an issue with uh, the uh, obstacle avoidance. I physically got on the phone and called the programmer. And in two weeks, he had a fix. Wow. So it's not, it, they don't leave you out in the wind. They really, they're really there. Their customer service is fantastic. You can call them up on the phone. You're not dealing with somebody overseas. You're dealing with somebody in Texas. And we really, really appreciate that. It's been fantastic for us. Leaving them out in the wind, uh, you might have to excuse the pun there, right? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Apple Farm Service, one of the great suppliers here in the Buckeye State, making sure not only you're getting a return on your investment, but keeping you on the cutting edge of what it takes to run your farming operation. Matt Apple has been our guest. Matt, thanks for joining us. Thank you very much. I appreciate your time. And we'll be back with more in Ohio Country today right after this.